Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Long time to see. Today we are doing a Halloween look. I think we're gonna do some sort of rainbow clown type of thing. We're gonna see how that goes now. I, I'm gonna glue my eyebrows down first because I need a smooth base so I can put the paint over the top of it. I'm just using an Elmer's washable glue stick. And I'm gonna take a spoolie and just brush that out. I'm gonna make them as smooth as possible and I'm gonna like layer this up like three or four times so we get a super smooth base. I almost said finish which I mean that makes sense too but whatever. And you just want to make sure you let it dry in between layers because otherwise it'll get weird. I'm gonna let that dry and I'll be right back. Now I'm gonna take a little bit of the color set translucent setting powder. I'm gonna put that over top of my eyebrows to set them in place and then I'm gonna put some color corrector on. Press it in to take away the tacky finish. So the color corrector that I'm using, this is the Becca Under Eye Brightening Corrector. This is like one of my favorite color correctors ever. It works really well and I'm so sad that Becca is like going out of business because I won't be able to get this anymore and that's gonna kinda suck. I know generally a lot of people, they tell you don't put uh, creams over powders, um, but in this case, putting the powder on top of the glue that we already had down and then putting the cream over the top of that, it's gonna help make it thicker, so it blocks it out more. I'm also gonna take the Anastasia Beverly Hills Banana Stick Contour. This is like super full coverage for whatever reason, and I'm just gonna run this over the top of this as well to help build up more coverage because it's not quite blocked out enough for my liking. Better, we're getting there. All right, so we're blocked out pretty well. I'm now going to actually take some liquid latex. I'm gonna put a thin layer of this over top of that so it'll seal it in. So again, we'll have another smooth base there. So now I gotta let that dry. So we'll be back again. Alrighty, so we're back. Um, I also just set that with a little bit more of the powder I used before. I'm gonna prime my face using the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. I'm gonna go ahead and put my base on first, and I'm gonna mix together the Flower Beauty Light Illusion Foundation in, what color is this? Ivory L2, and the NYX Total Control Drop Foundation in the shade Light, just to lighten this up a little bit. And there we go, I have no eyebrows. Cool, so it worked. <laughs> I'm gonna put on a little bit of concealer. I'm gonna use the Kylie Cosmetics Concealer. And now I'm just going to set my face with that same powder from before. I'm gonna use a powder puff to do so. I'm gonna take the Aeron Paradise Makeup AQ Pro Palette. It's freaking huge, it's bright, and it's paint. And I'm excited about it. So, so I'm gonna use the black. I'm gonna use an Inglot uh, gel liner and I'm gonna take a different brush. And I'm going to try to make the base look okay. I'm going to take a flat top brush and really like smudge out the edges here. Have that done. It looks okay. This is kind of messy, but we can clean that up. I'm gonna take some white. I'm gonna see if I can blend out the edges here. I gotta do the bottom. <laughs> I'm also gonna take the NYX, uh, what is this? Retractable eyeliner in black. And I'm gonna throw this in my waterline. Um, again, blending out the edges. See, the good thing about this is it doesn't have to look super clean to look cool. Okay, bro, this looks 10 times better with the white around it. Like it really does. I'm not gonna fill in the center underneath yet. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna put some silver stuff there. Um, or like glitter business. I'm going to do the rainbow twists around the top, I think. I'm gonna go ahead and take these neon liners from Profusion. So we're gonna start off with the pink one. And I don't know what this color is. It's just neon pink. Okay, so I'm closer and you can see what it looks like. Very twisty. I'm gonna clean up with more black in a little bit, I think. And lastly with the purple. Okay, so there's the top. 
Looking okay? Kinda? Sort of? Okay, so now that we are pink, literally pink, we're gonna put that away. We're back, looking a little dustier, a little dirtier. Um, I kind of went overboard with the breeze wheel. But hey, it is what it is. It's cool. It's all working. I need to fill in underneath my eyeball, and I don't know what to fill it in with. I think I maybe should just fill it in with black, but also. I don't know. I'm gonna take the 42 color bright matte palette from Didi Bay that I took before. Dude, this black is like so opaque, it's not even funny. So the glitter I'm gonna use is from Stila. This is the Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow in the color Diamond Dust. And I'm gonna mix it with a little bit of the Inglot uh, Duraline just to rehydrate it or whatever. Oh, what do we think about that? Terrible, great, good, awful. I'm gonna add a little glitter on the edges here. Gives a little shine. I'm gonna use the Doll Beauty. Uh, these are the Cocoa False Lashes. I don't know if these are gonna make that much of a difference, but I'm gonna put them on anyways. I need to figure out what I'm doing with my mouth. So I'm gonna go back in with the paint palette. I think I'm gonna take a little bit of this pink. Actually, I'm gonna take this other brush, a skinny one. I'm also gonna mix in a little bit of the red. That's kind of filled in there. Looks okay, actually, I think. Now I'm going to take some of the blood splatter and I'm gonna try to attempt to not get this everywhere. So um, I'm also taking some of the squirt blood and I've kind of already placed that on my face. I think I'm gonna take some of the neon liners again from Pro Fusion and do a couple streaks in the mouth. I'm just gonna add these in and then I'm gonna go and change and I think we'll be done. Also, I think I might dot some of this all over my face. This is one of like the coolest looks I've done in a hot minute. I will be right back. I'm gonna go change and fix my hair. We are back, my teeth are bloody, and it's just a great old time. Alrighty guys, so here we go. This is the finished look. I'm pretty happy with the way this came out, actually. I think the only thing that I could have done is like drag some blood down my neck and put it on my chest, but I don't really feel like doing that. Howdy. Did I film this outro already? Yes, I did. Did I have the office on in the background? Yes, I did. So, we're filming it again. If you liked today's video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more Halloween content, give me a thumbs up because I'm planning on filming all of my looks that I'm doing for like Halloween. Yeah. If you want to see more of those, let me know. Subscribe to my channel. That'd be cool. Um, you can also follow me on Instagram where I will have pictures of this on there. You can follow me at Alexis I think that's pretty much it. I will see you guys the next time that I see you. Peace out. Howdy people, what's up? How's it going? What the heck just happened? Let's just put those down. And I broke it again. What the freak, bro? What is on my thing? I literally just cleaned this the other day. What the heck? Letting it dry, letting it dry, letting it dry, letting it dry. And I'm gonna put a little bit of on a little well. So, you know. And now my face is gonna be drier than the Sahara Desert. Hmm. Epic. Don't drop them in the cup of water, that'd be bad. Cool, 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 cool. Dude, my shirt is so dirty. Do you see this? Can you see this? I don't know that you can see this in this light. Let me turn this down. Like, bro, what is up with this? 
It's so dirty. What the heck? Can I turn the lights back up? But yeah, like AW, Britt Baker. You know, cool. Anyways, um, so the glitter that I'm using, I'm using the. Well, that made no sense. <laughs> I think I'm gonna take. Gosh dang it. I was gonna do something else and I quite literally can't even remember what I was gonna do. Ugh. Fabuloso. 